Well, it's an industry that has meant tens of million, uh, millions of dollars in tax revenue to our state. And now recreational marijuana users might have another reason to visit their favorite dispensary. As News 3's Denise Rosh explains, a new company has come to town bringing with it cannabis beer. It's taken the company about 18 months to develop this idea and create a safe product. And right here behind me, this is their tank farm out near McCarran Airport. Inside the warehouse, employees are cranking out a first of its kind product. This is a fully automated line. Kevin Love says it's a craft beer whose time has come. It truly has zero hangover. Non-alcoholic and cannabis infused. It's called Two Roots and it's being produced by Love's company, Cannabineers, right here in Las Vegas. He calls it a good alternative to marijuana edibles. The consumer is being told, hey, you have a chocolate bar or a soda, which one do you want? But they're not being told, hey, you have something that you're already familiar with and is lifestyle integrated. It's been been just over a year since recreational marijuana sales kicked off in the valley and Love believes cannabis beer simply offers another choice for customers. Price? five dollars a can. It tastes really light and refreshing. Casey Thompson helped out in taste tests. The onset, which I love the most, is very fast. So one of the issues that I find with being a cannabis consumer, especially when it comes to edibles, is that you have to wait sometimes an hour or two hours to feel the effect. Along with beer, the company is also producing cannabis infused tea. Look for their products to hit dispensary shelves by mid-August. As for why start in Las Vegas, Love says with 43 million tourists annually, it only makes sense. So we wanted to start in this market where people would adopt the product a lot more easily, um, where we could um, fit in culturally in this market with a product like this. Denise Roche, News.